A star is going to explode this month, and we can see it in the night sky. And for a fleeting moment, the night will burn with ancient fire. Somewhere, 3,000 light years away, in the quiet void between the stars, a cosmic time bomb is nearing its final moments. T. Coronae Borealis, known ominously as the Blaze Star, is a recurrent nova, a dying ember locked in an endless cycle of destruction and rebirth. The last time it erupted, the world was very different. The year was 1946, an era before the internet, before men walked on the moon. Few were watching the sky when, for a brief moment, an invisible star became a beacon bright enough to be seen with the naked eye. And then, just as quickly as it appeared, it was gone. Now, nearly 80 years later, it is about to happen again. Astronomers have been waiting, watching, calculating. The explosion was predicted to happen between April and September of 2024. But the cold months passed in silence. The blaze star remained hidden, tucked away beyond the reach of our eyes. But that is about to change. As we enter March 2025, the constellation Corona Borealis, the northern crown, begins its slow rise into the night sky. It will first appear three hours after sunset, becoming clearly visible four hours after sundown. As the months pass, the constellation will rise earlier each night, making it easier to find. If you want to witness this rare event, you need to know where to look. Start by finding the Big Dipper. This familiar pattern, one of the most recognizable in the northern sky, will guide your way. Trace its curved handle, and you will find Arcturus, a bright orange star in the east. Then, look northeast for Vega, a brilliant blue-white star in the Lyra constellation. Between these two celestial sentinels lies Corona Borealis, a delicate crescent of seven faint stars. It is within this quiet cluster that the blaze star will ignite, an unfamiliar light among the familiar, burning fiercely before vanishing once more into the abyss. When it erupts, TKRB will briefly outshine its neighbors, appearing close to Epsilon CRB, the constellation's fifth brightest star. For a time, it will seem as if the cosmos itself has changed, as if a new star has been born in the crown of the sky. But this is no birth. It is a death, a violent thermonuclear explosion tearing through the surface of a dying white dwarf. We do not know the exact moment it will happen. It could be days from now or weeks, but it will happen. And when it does, those who look up at the right time will witness something truly rare. A star devouring itself in fire, only to disappear into darkness once again. For another lifetime.